Hi there, and welcome everybody to this limited overs exhibition match. I'm Mark Nicholas, and I'll be with you throughout the day. Let me tell you, it promises to be a belter. Well, this pitch is wet, as wet as I've ever seen it, and I really would have to bowl first if I won the toss. I think it'll stop and be very hard to play strokes on. I think it'll move around off the seam too. Well, that's a surprise. I know there's an old adage about looking to bat first on almost every occasion. But these days, people look differently at winning the toss, and frequently captain choose to bowl in conditions much less promising than this. We've got plenty of grass on the pitch, we've got cloudy skies overhead. I think the fast bowlers will have a delightful walk. Stopped in the covers. in the covers. Stopped in the covers. Stopped in the covers. is now facing. Well, I think he's bowled well enough to deserve a wicket. made a change to the field. Stopped in the covers. It's edged and out. That was a big deflection, no doubt about it. An early wicket like that puts such pressure on the batting side. This was the end of the innings for Ma. Collingwood is the new batsman. No need for him to play at those. That's been given as a wide. Got him, yes, he's out. Great reflexes, he made it look so easy. The bowling side are now allowed more players outside the ring as the fielding restrictions have been lifted. That's a big appeal. He's out. Out for me. I don't even think it's a conversation. Dawson gets his first wicket. We can have a look at that again. Harmison is the next batsman in. Struck in front. Gone. Well, I reckon when we watch the replay, we'll see this is plum. This was how the innings ended for Harmison. The next man in is Mustard. Steered expertly into the gap. 
fielded by the man at long on. Benkenstein facing. Dawson is switching to round the wicket. No shot played to that one. Wide ball signaled by the umpire. I'm not sure if he'll be able to continue. He looks to be in some pain. the gap with precision the run rate is rising all the time the batsman must know that they have to know to hit the accelerator pedal now that struck him in front loud appeal he's out good decision very good decision Vaughan gets his first wicket Mushal is the next man in He looks as if he might be hurt. Oh, that's close. Yes, he's been given. Out, no issue. Vaughan gets his second wicket. Wow, this has been quite a spell of bowling. Another wicket, and so well deserved. Low facing. to continue with his offspin. That has to be close. He's given him. Definitely gone. He's a goner. That's the third wicket now for Dawson. It's been a great spell of bowling. He's troubled everybody and deserved those wickets. Brees comes in at number eight. Confident appeal. Yes, he's given him. Not a difficult decision for the umpire to make. That is out. Dawson gets his fourth wicket. Top class bowling today, perfect lengths, perfect lines, and no batsman really finding the answer. the umpire signal, no ball. He's got him, he's gone. I don't know whether he just lost the line of the ball or something, but I mean, it's gone through yeah. bad, bad and done it easily. He's gone for a duck. Well, he hasn't troubled the scorers with that knock. Let's take a look at that in uh, slow motion. The next man in is Lewis. Lewis waiting at the striker's end. There's the umpire signal, no ball. Oh, big shout for that one.
so much for the opening batsmen to do as they make their way to the middle. It's a formidable new ball attack against them. Up in the commentary box is Richie Van. Turn that into two, that's good running. What a super stroke. Do you know, I didn't think that was a bad ball either. That's a brilliant shot, right off the meat of the bat. Ouch, that must have hurt. There it goes. Sayers moves into double figures with those runs. The sweeper picks up. Yep, that'll do it. That gives them an excellent win in this important limited overs fixture.